Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. I want to spend a bit of some time to show you something that is going to encourage you and just maybe to appreciate the power of spreadsheets to be a bit of some magic. I'll use only three things, red, green, and blue, and with a series of numbers that range from zero to 255. Please stick around and see what is going to happen. You will witness magic. Why I'm doing this, I just want to encourage so many of financial or finance experts, and even in other specialization, to dedicate their time in passionately learning financial modeling and maybe visualization. So let's start, see the magic. I've used this magic at Zambia Institute of Chartered Accountants when I was called to go and present. So let's do it. Okay. I created these numbers. They are not randomly created. It took me a lot of time, maybe three or so weeks to creating these numbers. But these numbers, they range from zero Zandi, from zero, to 255. They are technically done. Just trying to show you that these are just ordinary numbers. Mm -hmm. There's nothing there. So you can see this is a blank spreadsheet. Mm -hmm. It takes a lot of skill, a lot of patience, and maybe dedication to do what I did. So we'll start. We'll use three colors, red, green, and blue. Let's start. That's RGB. All the colors that you see, they're actually represented by three. Or should I say, there are only three colors. Anything else is a mixture of these colors, maybe, <laughs> for or lack of. So I'll do this. I'll go to home. I'll go to conditional formatting. Please don't go, don't go, don't go. I'll go to new rule. I'll come here. And this is what I'm going to do. I'll show number on the minimum, zero. I'll start with, because it's RGB, red, green, blue. So I'll start with the red. First black. Black means there's no color, it's just zero. Then the color that I want is red. So I'll pick red. Press OK. I'll explain these colors later. I'll then go to, you go to condition formatting, go to new rule, come here. What do I do? Number, which is zero. Obviously black is, black, black means there's no color basically. Then I'll go to there, red, green. So I'll go to green. I want to pick pure green. Okay, red, green. Red, green, then I go to blue. New row, black, red, green, and blue. I pick pure blue. Okay. Oh, sorry. Should have started from here. Number black, red, green, and blue. Okay. Mm -hmm. We have these numbers. 
so sorry mm -hmm. <coughs> so That's formatting. Okay. Now, pick from here. Go to home, go to format. So this is how these numbers work. If I type zero, for example, here, it's going to turn to black, definitely. If I type 255, it's going to turn to white. Is it white or color? It's green, I mean, pure green. Mm -hmm. Okay. So if here I, I type, to 50, it's going to be a bit red. Yes, okay. These colors, you can still find them here. More colors, just to understand, this is where you have your RGB. The maximum is 255, the minimum is zero. And it's red, green, and blue. Hmm. So then we will go to view, check what is going to happen. We'll do a custom zooming at 10%. Who is there? Look carefully, who is there? Okay. Thank you so much. That's the power of Excel. It's all about zeros and, and 255. In short, we are all spreadsheets. We are representations of numbers from zero to 255. Thank you so much and bye-bye.